I could not be here breathing and be comfortable if I was really as bad as they was making, you know, and nobody could be around me. So for me to be this calm, I must have some kind of inner peace. And my inner peace is knowing that once everybody takes the time to really see what type of person I am, you'd be surprised that I stuck around this long. I have to make the life that I do live as happy as I can and try to do the best with what I have. Do, you know, live the best life I can live, be as happy as I can be. N nothing is perfect for anybody. I don't know. Boys, I swear, I think I figured it out. You know why they don't want us redneck brothers and sisters and the hood brothers and sisters getting along? You know why? Because we'd be unstoppable. I'm telling you right now, we would shut shit down. Or mute their phones until you're speaking. Thank you. Um, I just want to announce again that if any resident that is watching this would like to communicate with the board, can you please send an email to communications at vodalton.org. Again, that is communications at vodalton.org. Next, we have anybody have any general announcements? Mayor, if I could be recognized. Sure, go ahead, trustee. Okay. Uh, on that point of the communications, I know we had some debate before, and I think the well, my stance will be still be the same. They're still concerned about the Open Meetings Act and wanting the residents to have access to um, the chat at, at a minimum, since we don't have access to, to present and communicate with the board. So I'm asking if we can put the, reinstate the chat. I mean, if you want to have them dalton.org as well, it's fine. But I'm asking so that we can move forward with the meeting if that function can be reinstated for the residents in the community. Okay, so at this time, trustee, we're gonna do it through the email chat. There's nothing illegal about what um, I've done as relates to communicating through the e email. Um, I have not violated any open means act. And then also that every residents are being heard by communicating through the email chat. All I'm trying to do is make sure that we get through our meeting in a timely, fashion without all the back and forth or all the issues. I just want to go along with the agenda and move forward. Right now, advising the Board of Trustees, we need to pay the bills. By you guys grandstanding the last meeting and not paying the bills, a lot of important things did not get taken care of. So I'm asking that we move forward and the residents will be heard as always, but it's just through the email process. Well, So then to that point, uh, I'm in disagreement, so I'll renew my ask if not then i would say that i would suggest that as a board that we adjourn again and the board will call a special in-person meeting next week because we recognize that the bills do have to get paid and all these issues have to be resolved i don't the residents i feel that we've already given them distance by having the zoom format and then we further not answered. I mean, it, it was supposed to be going through the chat function and put on the website. The last time the website was updated is in is in August, August 30th. So I'll ask again if we can do that. If not, well, then I would say that as a, I would say we're going to want a motion to adjourn the meeting till next week. We'll post a special meeting for in person, so that way this will no longer be an issue. I believe this is a simple enough issue that you have the authority to. Uh, make the difference, but if you choose not to, uh, I guess that's your prerogative. Yes, it is. So with that being said, I am not for the chat. Um, I don't appreciate you guys constantly counseling meetings because you don't have it your way. And I'm stating that we are being able to communicate with residents by communicating through the email chat. As relates to in-person meeting, I already stated that I was working on that. And you know, just like everyone up here knows, that Village Hall is being remodeled. So we're not doing in-person meetings until the new beginning of next year. If anybody will call me to find out what my plans are or what it is that I'm doing, that would have been helpful. So you guys want to do the chat? We could do the chat today. I, you know what? This is showing me compromise. We could do the chat today. Thank Go you ahead. very much. Uh, oh, yeah, I'll tell you. They want the chat. Let them have the chat. So Ontario, read all the uh, email uh, questions into record. But go ahead. They want the chat. Go ahead with the drama. Thank that's you very much, Mayor. There's, there's nothing but drama. So, um, and thank y'all for pointing out that a lot of trustees are trolls as it relates to the chat 
because I didn't understand why that was so important to have if people are really truly communicating uh, with actual questions through the email function. Uh, with the chat, it's just a drama show. It ain't, it's nothing of importance. Um, and normally it's hard for Ontario to filter out the questions that's needed um, to be addressed. So that's my issue with the, uh, the live chat. But you want it, you got it. So moving Mayor, on. Thank to, you. Thank you for the grandstand. You, you, you so welcome. Can, I'm we're ready to move forward with the meeting. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. But I still was talking, trustee. So thank you. Please, please, y'all wish I would learn Robert Rules of Order and uh, call on or speak when addressed. So I would appreciate that. So moving on next um, is Citizens Address. Ontario, do we have anything for Citizens Address? We do. Uh, give me one moment. I'm pulling the email up. All right. Thank you so much. All right. So the citizens address, this is from Mary Jackson. She actually has um, a few questions. Um, is the convicted employee still working for the village of Dalton? When is Dorothy Brown's last day for the village? Is the mayor using taxpayers money to pay her PR person? Why hasn't any citizen questions been answered on the website since August? Will the mayor receive a traffic? Hold on, let me reread this. It's not worded correctly. Will the mayor receive a traffic ticket for paying back, paying her car in reverse down a, a whole block in the whole lane, almost hitting another vehicle? Um, and then Ms. Jessica Jefferson has a question. I'm going to just read. I'm sorry. I'm just reading through a lot of these. I'm just getting them now. Um, this is a statement. It's not a question. All right. I want the old format for citizens address. Is the mayor afraid of answering live questions? The citizens of Dalton deserve to have their questions answered live right away. And... Where can I view a record of the questions asked and answered by Dalton's board meetings? That is all in the email that I received so far today. Thank you very much, Mayor. Excuse me, Trustee. Um, I'm working on just letting you know I'm working on getting the, the chat live again, okay? We want to, there are. May I be recognized? Yes, you sure. Go ahead. I got a question. These The comments that's being disabled. Uh, the you said that the um, that the, the they've been disabled for a reason. I just stated the way to communicate with us is via email. The email address is communications at vo.dalton.org. Well, I wish I mean you know the residents have been used to this for the last since we've been in COVID, and y'all didn't announce that y'all would disable the comments. That's not a that's a technical thing that have the the person has to be told to do that. So okay. for the okay. record. So for, for the record, you got to, you have, you should disable at least let the residents know this meeting. We're not going to accept comments this meeting, but send your stuff into the communications email. Okay. But to disable the comments without letting nobody know is completely wrong. Okay. I haven't done anything wrong for the record. Um, I've stated this at several board meetings forward. I've stated this again in the beginning of this meeting that send your comments, send your questions, communications at vo.org. Last meeting, we read questions that was emailed to us into the record if you guys want to go back and check it. So we're going to move on. We're not going to argue over that. If anybody has a question or comment, communications at vo.org. No, communications at vo.dalton.org. Moving on. Ma'am, may, may, may I be okay, recognized real quick? Let's see. We want to move forward. So we no, I'm asking, forward. can I be recognized, ma'am? I have a question. No, not right now. We want to move forward with the uh, corporate bills. So let's go. So are you yeah. you're not going to answer my question, ma'am? No. We're okay. going to move forward to the next thing, which is corporate bills. Trustee House, you have the floor. Okay. Yeah, well, Mayor, I think um, we, if the board wants to have a question, I would prefer that we ask it. So I would rather either we suspend the rules so that they can ask the question. Or I would prefer well, that trustee. You guys will have to question. suspend the rules. We're not going to argue and debate every okay. board. Well, we're here I'll, to take care of business. Wait one minute, trustee. We're here to take care of business. And that's what we're going to do. We're not going to argue over every little thing, every board meeting. Other than that, we'll be at a meeting all night. 
So what I'm stating is let's keep going so we can get through our agenda, which is is so, what I'm saying. All okay, we do is go back and forth. I already spoke to the question, which is how do the, the board and how do uh, residents communicate? That's through the email. Mm -hmm. So, Mayor. No, he needed to suspend or whatever y'all going to do. I would say, Mayor, the, it seems to me at this point, the back and forth, the trustee hadn't even asked the question. So it gives me the feeling that we're not allowed to ask a question or if perceived as an argument. So just to follow your directive, I motion that we suspend the rules so that trustee Nora can ask her question. Okay, and then for the record to you, trustee House, and I make the statement if I'm saying that we're gonna move forward, that's my stance. It's not to go back and forth with anyone. My stance is to run the board meeting. So my stance is not to sit here and get off record track to go over other things that's not related to what we're discussing, which is the agenda. But go ahead, your motion is accepted. Is there a second? Second. A second. Okay. I'll call the roll call, Keith. Okay. Uh, Trustee Steve? Aye. Trustee Norwood? Aye. Ever since I was young, my dream has been to open a chocolate shop. To make unique, colorful... Trustee Belcher? Aye. Trustee Holmes? Aye. <laughs> uh, Trustee Brown? Aye. Trustee House? Aye. This is a motion. All right, go ahead. Leah, I was just simply asking because I have residents contacting me and they were just wondering. So my question to you was moving forward, are you saying to the residents that they will no the chat will continue to be discontinued and that they will no longer be able to comment, but they'll have to email the questions prior to the meeting for citizens address? Right. Are you changing okay. citizens address? I already answered that, so my I right. still stands for the record. Whatever I just said previously still okay. Just okay, thank you, I mean, I just want the residents no to problem. know. Thank you, I appreciate it. I already answered that. Any other okay. questions? Any other questions? All right, um, let's yeah. go back to the board yeah. meeting. No, wow. sir, no ma'am, no ma'am, uh, no ma'am. <laughs> okay, okay, so no. next, uh, moving forward to- so we, we have, we still, we're still in suspension oh, you, got, you got one more, go ahead, go ahead. Yes. What you yes. This is, it's not about what I got. You can't just steamroll everything, man. You can't do that. You got to be respectful of what we're saying. You didn't, we, you realize in COVID, we've been, at, we've been on Zoom for the last year or two years. Then when you've got one, you don't take answers. You don't question, answer, answer no questions that's in his address. A number of people text me and say, I sent my question and still haven't get an answered. And then now you're disabled to comments, no announcement. And then, okay, so I'm disabled. That's what we're, we're going to do. You got to communicate better with the board. And with the residents, it's the right, it's the wrong way to do it. You just can't steamroll whatever. You just can't bully your way through this stuff. You still have a board that you got to communicate. The way you're doing it is all wrong. It's all wrong. So understand you're going to disable the comments, but you never announced that. Nobody knows that. And they've been used to the comments for the last year, two years. That's unacceptable. Unacceptable. Okay. For, for the record, again, for the 18th time, my uh, comment still stands. Go to communication. C O M M U N I C A T I N O S at C O Dalton dot org if you have any questions or comments. And if you guys go back to the previous meetings, this is the way we did it. No one's bullying anyone. I call all of you. I've said that several times. No one returns my calls. So stop it. Tell the true trustees I reach out to you. You do not respond to me. So that's where we are. We're not going to hold up a meeting to go back and forth over things that we're not doing. I've called all of y'all. So stop with the grandstand. So let's go back to the business of the agenda, which that's what we're here to do, which is the corporate business. Can I, can I be recognized? A statement for the record, statement noted. Can I make, can I be recognized? You can make your statement. Go ahead, trust me. Um, is the attorney on here? Because I want to ask, is this uh, legal for Open Meetings Act that the citizens don't have a voice? So I just want the attorney to speak. Okay, the citizens do have a voice, so y'all can stop saying that. Okay, I just asked for the attorney, Mayor. Okay, you have your own attorney. So. I don't care which attorney answer. I just want the attorney, any attorney on there. They, they all municipal law to answer the question. <laughs> okay. Any attorney? Okay. Next, anybody else have a question? Any other questions? Uh, the attorney is about to speak. Oh, you responded? Okay, go ahead. 
Uh, trustee, I, I am, I'm not going to give a legal opinion to the board in public. I will give a confidential legal opinion analyzing the Open Meetings Act and answering your questions. Okay, thank you so much. I made a motion to adjourn this meeting. Yep, I second it. I second it. Okay, well, just for the record, you guys got to learn to get out your feeling because you still got to take care of the business at hand. So with that being said, that means, hold on, pause. That means that the residents suffer because you guys want to be petty. All right. It relates to you don't get your way about me stating that this is the way it's going to be done. That has nothing to do with giving the services that's needed to the community and voting like they're supposed to do. You guys get paid to come mm -hmm. here and do the will of the people, not to argue and bicker with Mayor Henry. So by you guys' journey, that means that all the things that all these department heads placed on the agenda is not going to do. And you are really disrespectful, Trustee Boucher, just so you know. So you have to grow up, please. So with that being said, if you guys would like to adjourn the meeting, by all means, go right ahead. That means that a lot of important things that we truly need will not get accomplished because you guys want to adjourn the meeting. So is, that was, a, was there a motion, Clerk Key, so we can move forward? So was this motion by Belcher and second by Norwood? I'm asking you. I don't know. I'm not the rest No, I'm asking them. Is, is our attorney on? Yes. Yes. There was a motion by Belcher and a okay. second by Norwood to okay. adjourn this meeting. Okay. So let me do the roll call. Please. Thank you Trustee so much. Steve, Trustee Steve? No. No, I don't want to adjourn this meeting. Okay. Trustee Norwood? Aye. Trustee Belcher? Aye. Holmes, Trustee Holmes. No, no. Trustee Brown. Aye. Trustee House. I had a question before this one. Um, do we have a date that we were going to adjourn it to? I think we should adjourn it until Thursday or somewhere because we do want to make sure the bills get paid. But I'm, I'm in favor. I believe the residents should have a voice. Was there a date proposed for the? Um, they already sent out a special meeting for Wednesday, so we can have it at the special meeting. I don't care. But at this point, since legal counsel it cannot provide us the answers we need, I think that we need to have um, conversations with attorneys. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm asking that you do not adjourn the meeting so we can get through this and vote on the bills and all the other things that you guys said you agreed to. And we can move forward as it relates to communications with the board and with uh, residents. We do talk to them through email. Last meeting, last meeting, hold on, last meeting, we had this conversation. Last meeting, I stated the same thing I'm stating now, which is go to communications at vo.org. People sent the emails in. We read them into record. So what's any different from today's meeting? It's the same thing. It's not so the same thing. Not to have a meeting, it doesn't make sense. I, I, is there a plan? And I will say this. I think maybe you know, this has gone kind of difficult. I mean, for in-person meetings, I think that would alleviate a lot of this. Well, we're working on that. I'm working on that currently as well. Because we're right now we remodeling Village Hall. So that is coming too. Um, well, I, trustee, trustee, this, this is not the same thing. They have never disabled comments mm -hmm. in the last trustee, two years. The last, the last meeting. Was was done. Let's see. The last meeting, I did this same setup. The last meeting. Go back and look at it. Uh -huh. They sent it through email. I'm not making that up. So now when we get here, how's any different? I just did it the last meeting. And like you I said, said if everyone's paying meeting. attention or had any comments or questions, all y'all could call me. I say that every meeting. No one calls me. Then we get here and we grandstand. And then we don't want to take care of the business for the people. That's not right. Mayor, we work for the people, Mayor. Mayor. We work for the people. And all I'm saying and is I work we for the be people, able to... So let them they can't go on a and let them have a voice. Back and forth and argue and bicker. It's just let them have a voice, mayor. Not the just let them have a voice, mayor. They have a voice. They have a voice. They have a voice. No one can take voice away. The way it's they, it's it's they, it's it's they communicate now is through email instead of going back and forth on a chat. So how did I not give them a voice? I wish you would communicate that with us, man. Hold on. And if you look at the last meeting, I read the same thing I'm stating to you right now in the record. And we read the questions in the record. Man, this is the first time I've ever heard the chat. This is not the first time. Okay, so we're, we're at, on this one, I'm going to, I do want to get the legal opinion on Open Meetings Act prior to proceeding. I do have some concerns about that. I suggest Thursday because we, because we don't have enough time to put up the proper agenda as the rescheduled date. And that would allow for the attorney to give the, um, the legal opinion so that way hopefully we can move forward uh, my vote is i uh, on on adjourning until thursday 
Okay, Clark Key. What's on my face? I could not be here breathing and be comfortable if I was really as bad as they was making, you know, and nobody could be around me. So for me to be this calm, I must have some kind of inner peace. And my inner peace is knowing that once everybody takes the time to really see what type of person I am, you'd be surprised that I stuck around this long. I have to make the life that I do live as happy as I can and try to do the best with what I have. Do, you know, live the best life I can live, be as happy as I can be. N nothing is perfect for anybody. I don't know. Boys, I swear, I think I figured it out. You know why they don't want us redneck brothers and sisters and the hood brothers and sisters getting along? You know why? Because we'd be unstoppable. I'm telling you right now, we would shut shit down. Drunk as f yeah. Yeah, slide, slide. Oh, my slide, slide. Slide, slide. Imagine if my small business blew up overnight and I woke up to some sales. Boost this video so people who like my products can find me. Algorithm. Where you at, bitch? Cause I'm tired of posting viral content and getting two and a half likes. We finna fight, ho. Yeah.